I have here another work in progress. This is going to be a uh, Axial Flux Wind Turbine and this is a stator donated to me by C. Wayne Hawk. He was very kind and uh, I have had this for a few months and I haven't been able to work on it because of the weather. This is 9 coil, I think either 18 or 20 gauge wires, I'm not sure. And um, I have the blades, and this is the one I made for my ceiling fan motor. I think about six and a half, half feet long. And I'm gonna use my ceiling fan motor as a hub, and also it's gonna be the holder or part of the structure for the rotor plates and this is the saw blade rotors this is a seven and a quarter inch I know I should be using thicker steel plates but I just don't have the, the uh, know-how to cut them or to have them custom made for that purpose and I'm gonna take the bearing from it one of the ceiling fan covers and I'm gonna put them in here so this would be the front bearing and the rear bearing is just gonna be this one here that I spot welded to the saw blade there's a little bit of a blade guard here sort of like a some kind of a tubing um, I think it's okay as long as you don't try to grab the hub or anything like that uh, what else do I have? Yeah, so I'm just gonna drill four holes for the quarter inch uh, nuts and bolts that I'm gonna use. These are the nuts and bolts I'm gonna use. Probably stainless steel would be better. So this goes into the blade, hopefully. So what I plan to do next is uh, to weld some tubing to the hub here so it can support the stator. The stator will of course be sandwiched between the magnet plates and uh, the tail would be a little bit longer of course uh, I'm gonna get a coupler and buy more 5-8 uh, uh, threaded rods to make it to make the tail a little longer and then uh, maybe well some kind of uh, support so it will pivot and then of course I would have to install the magnets too. I have some magnets but not enough. I will probably try to add layers of magnet instead of using just one or one big magnets. 